Amen. I'm happy to have you on this YouTube channel. Thank you for choosing Royal Chu as your best crypto trading bot, the one which has proven itself operating for almost, almost two years in the market. People are using it. People are making a lot of money out of it. Really, Royal Chu is the best crypto trading bot out there. It operates on different exchanges like Binance. It operates on Hobby. It operates on Bybit and other exchanges which are proven. So Royal Chu is the best crypto trading bot. So today I'm here to show you how to bind your Royal Chu trading robot on Binance. So I'm going to present to you on how to bind your API key or API binding with Binance. So stay tuned on the channel as I present to you on how to bind Royal Chu on your Binance. So ladies and gentlemen, we are going to begin the process of our binding Binance on Royal Chu. So first of all, we shall go into our app. Sorry, we shall go into our app of Royal Chu. Here it is. I'll open it. Once I open Royal Chu app, I will choose API binding. It's just on the home page when you open Royal Chu. You can find it here, API binding. Here it is. I hope you can see it. If you don't use that section on the home page, you can go here. Sorry. You can go here. On mine, you can tap there. When you tap on mine, you can also tap here on API binding. When you tap on API binding, it brings connect to your exchanger. So since I'm connecting Binance, you see the different exchanges we are going to, we can bind with Royal Chu and the exchanges. We see Binance, the first one, the best exchange I can recommend. Hobby, also indicated there. Coinbase, Indoxta, Kraken, Bybit, and OK Exchange. But for us, we are going to bind Binance. Why Binance? I'm not here to back up any exchanger, but I can recommend Binance as the best exchanger also out there. So when I tap on Binance, it's here. When I tap on Binance, it will open up like this in my Royal Chu. So now afterwards, I will go to Binance. I will go to Binance. I will search where is my Binance. Here we go. Here is my Binance app. So when I tap on Binance, it will open like this. Just a minute. <clears throat> okay, here we go. Here is my Binance. When I tap on Binance, this is the homepage of my Binance account. I will tap on more. I know most of you, when you are using the phone, you are able to see this section for more. So when I tap on more, I can scroll down to look for API management. API management, where are you? It's just right here. So when I tap on API management, here we go. I tap on API management. Just a minute, wait it for it to open, okay. When I op it opens up like this, I'll tap on create API on this section. When I tap on create API, it shows me choose API key type, system generated, system generated, okay. Then I can tap here because I want system generated. Then here I can type in Royal Chu, most especially even in capital letters because it's the best crypto trading bot I've ever used on the world. So when I type in my Royal Chu word as it is, then I can click on next. It will bring like this. This is a security future on Binance. Here we go. So I have to input all these security measures on Binance. So I'll first get that of the email verification. I go, I go on to email verification. Okay, here we are. 
I scroll, I copy it, go back to the Binance app, paste it out there. Then I can also get the code for the phone. Okay, when I get go to the messages, just a minute, the message is already here. I can copy it, go back to my app, paste it there. Then I also need Google Authenticator. This is an increased security. Google Authenticator. It's an increased security on your Binance, which you can put if you want to, to like to safeguard your funds on Binance. It's also an increased security. Then I can look for Google Authenticator in my phone. Here we are. Then I can copy Binance. It's already copied. Then I can paste it in my app. Here we are. Then I can say submit. Okay, API key created successfully. Then after creating the API key, I'll tap down here on that section. I'll tap here down here on this section. So when I tap there, this section is able to open up fully like this so after binance gives me is this api key so binance has given me the api key and also the secret key so first of all i will copy the secret key copy it to the clipboard then i'll go back to my royal chew which i opened earlier then paste the secret key successfully copied and pasted then i'll go back to my binance app also copy the api key which is this one i will copy it sorry i have copied it successfully then i'll go back to my royal Two app paste the api key which is pasted successfully after I've pasted my API key and the secret key, I will go back to Binance. When I go back to Binance, I will go to the section where it says edit. You can see the edit section here. So I will tap on edit. When it comes to edit, it will open up several options here which I have to make some editing. Then I will go down here where it says restrict access to trusted IPs only. So I will tap here. Then I will go forward and tap. So I will go back to my Royal Chu app, copy the IP binding group address, copy successfully, then come back to my Binance app, then paste it. It's pasted successfully. After pasting it, I confirm it. So it's confirmed into the system then i will go back up here since i'm doing some editings of what i want like the limitations i have to give my royal true robot on my binance account so i'll give it the only enable reading which is here and also enable spot trading which is this enable reading and enable spot and margin trading i don't give it any other option like enable margin loan repair i don't do it enable futures none permits universal transfers no this is no this is no enable withdrawals no a big no it cannot have access to any withdrawals on my funds in binance enable european options no en enable symbol whitelist no so all those options are not permitted i'm only permitting or enabling spot and margin trading yes i've clicked it after doing so, I confirm my IP binding group address is already confirmed. Then I will go to where it says save. Okay, I'm saving. Then Binance needs another verification. So I have to go back to my Google Authenticator app. Copy the Google code. It's an increased security which everybody needs to have. Then I've submitted it. 
So it has shown me edit API successfully. So I have successfully locked in all what I wanted to lock it in my Binance app. So it's successfully locked up. Then I will go back to my Royalty app. I also have to lock up here in my Royalty app. So I've already pasted my IP key and the, also the secret key. Then I will also confirm it. So they have sent a verification on my email. So I'll go back to my email. Okay, here it is. I will copy it. Take it back to my Royal app. I will paste it. Sorry. I'll paste it like that. I've confirmed. I've read all the terms and conditions of API binding. Then I bind. Bind or bond successfully. Congratulations. So we have binded Binance on Royal Q successfully. So that's how we bind Binance on Royal Q. Thanks guys for following up. Please, I recommend using Royal Chu because this is the best, best, best crypto bot. There are many bots out there, but I recommend Royal Chu as the best trading crypto bet. It operates on the spot market of Binance. Securely transacts there using the Matingo strategy and the grid bot. The next, I've done many videos on how to use Royal Chu using the grid bot inside it. And I've also done a video on the Matingo strategy. So keep following and subscribe to the YouTube channel for more videos on how to use Royal Chu, the best crypto trading bot out there. Thanks, guys. See you then.